Hello, all you 13-year-old and olders. Bully Neck here, and this is the very first episode of Season 4 on the Mind Saga server. Now, that was a weird intro, I know, and it's been a while since I've been putting videos out. Uh, for those of you that don't know, there's a lot going on on YouTube at the moment with the, the Children Online Privacy Protection Act, and the FTC is suing YouTube and all that kind of stuff. And uh, I've been reading over it, uh, trying to learn up on it, and I think I'm okay. Uh, the thing is, the deal is, if you say your video is not targeting children when your video is targeting children, uh, you can get sued, you can lose your channel, there's a lot of bad stuff that can happen. So I've been reading up on that, so I apologize, the videos haven't been coming out that fast. Uh, on top of that, I just need a little break after last season. Uh, during In It to Win It, you guys wouldn't believe the hours I was putting in. Uh, I didn't I didn't get to hang out with my family at all for like four weeks. Uh, didn't get any exercise, no going to the gym, no having fun, no going to family things. I spent a uh, day and night doing videos and uh, playing this because after I'm done playing this, then I have to edit videos and put videos together and make thumbnails and all that kind of stuff, which I enjoy that a lot. I'm not saying I'm not complaining about that, but uh, when you're playing to win, that's a full-time job in itself. And then on top of that, trying to do videos and have a family life. And, oh, it just didn't mix. So this season, I am not doing that. Uh, especially because, I mean, it is the holiday season. I'm not going to give up my holidays. Uh, right now, it's getting close to Thanksgiving for those of us in the United States, which is a uh, a pretty fun holiday. We all get to get together and eat a big feast and, and get fat. And uh, yeah, even more reason I need to uh, get back to going to the gym put on a few pounds last season even because I would think I think I was sitting at my computer from morning till night most days and uh, uh, it was it was too much so this season we are not competing like that we may get in you know the top five uh, it may happen but I am not I'm not going out of my way for it I'm not this season I don't have a goal yet and I'm kind of lost uh, I don't know what I want to do yet. Everybody's been asking, and I haven't come up with anything. I've had a few ideas, but none of them, none of them are too great. Uh, I actually have some better ideas for for future seasons, but they don't work so much for this season because of the holidays coming up. I'm also starting a new series. I've already released the first video. It is a survival multiplayer, and it is on the Lucidity uh, Minecraft server, which is a, a ton of fun. I'm having a lot of fun there. I haven't had enough time to do as much as I want there, uh, but I am having a blast there. So I hope you guys tune in and check that out because we are having a lot of fun. Uh, that's something I've always wanted to do and I am looking forward to so much. Uh, there's already, I think, uh, maybe six of us over there playing on it and more coming all the time. And it is going to be amazing. I hope you guys enjoy it. I am enjoying it already. So in today's video, I'm just going to go over what I've done so far. I recorded the first day when I was on here, and it was a big, hectic mess. Everybody was running around. It was all crazy. Um, it, it was just a mess. So I thought it would be better to start all over, start fresh with some new footage, and just do a recap of what's happened so far. Um, so far on the team, this isn't even my island. I made an island with Joe TGF. This is what I do every season. Uh, this island will eventually be kind of left behind. This is the Cactus Beginner Island. And I will make an island with Budley Neck uh, probably pretty soon. Pretty soon. And uh, this will end up just being for alts to AFK. Alley Knack is here, and he is doing his redstone stuff. I'm not sure what he's got going on over here. He's got something started over here, but he did make us our potion brewer, which is very, very nice for doing dungeons and stuff. Very cool. Thank you so much, Alley Knack, for that. And he, he organized this stuff. He is really good at organizing uh, we had everything on the first day. It was really hectic, and I just made a bunch of chests and dumped everything in. And I think everybody else was just dumping everything. And uh, Alinak went ahead and got all that sorted out. Um, let's take a look at what we've done. The other night, I made a couple of rock lobsters down here for anybody that wants to level up their mining. Uh, we don't have any blaze yet, no XP, so you have to sit here and watch it. And uh, if you have a, uh, let me take a look at my pick here. I have a pick named. Um, AFK Miner. There we go. So this is really what you want. If you have Efficiency 5, and you can craft that up yourself. You don't need a kit. You can just get a crafting table and some uh, uh, bookshelves and craft this up yourself. But you want Mending 6 and Enliven 3. Uh, let me go ahead and get that up. 
and this will auto mine. This will uh, instant mine. I'm sorry. Uh, so it will get the entire row. It will clear this out as fast as it can go. And this is a good way to level your mining skill. So I would suggest making yourself up one of those. And if you haven't joined my Discord yet, join my Discord. And the schematic for the Rock Lobster is on my Discord. So we've been doing this every now and then. And uh, I got to say, I have been turning my computer off at night. This is the first I've been able to turn my computer off in months. I've left it running because I was either stacking blocks or I had uh, alts running, collecting XP, and, and who knows what. I mean, I, I have a VPS that I usually run my alts on, but you can't stack blocks on a VPS. So uh, I wasn't able to do that and turn my PC off at night. And uh, it just seemed like there was always something going on where I couldn't turn my PC off at night. Uh, AFK mining, right? That's what I've been doing the past few weeks with bully neck i've been uh, leaving my pc on with something on my mouse and afk mining uh but yeah i my goal this season is to turn my pc off and to be able to maybe watch a show with my family every now and then and go to some movies and uh, start going back to the gym and get pumped up and i'm gonna have to because thanksgiving we eat so much in christmas time uh I'll, I'll get fat i mean i'm gonna sit here and get fat if i keep these hours up so i have got to start going back to the gym uh, those are some of my goals this season. I don't have a goal yet on Mind Saga. On Mind Saga, I haven't set a goal yet. And that's weird. It's making it really hard to do a video because I don't have a goal to work towards. So that is where I'm hoping that you guys can help me out. What's a good idea for a goal this season? But it's got to be a goal that isn't going to take 24-7. Uh, it's the holiday time. We do a lot of the holiday stuff at our house. That means we have guests coming over a lot. We have parties to plan for uh, we have meals to plan for and all that so if you guys have any ideas for a goal that i should do this season let me know um right now i'm just going to kind of keep doing recaps and keep you guys up to date on what i'm doing and what's going on and if i have any new ideas new farm ideas that kind of stuff i will let you know um this season i think i'm going to do witches instead of silverfish if i'm not going to be stacking witches will make you more money so do witches you guys if you're if you're not going to stack the blocks now, silverfish are better if you're going to stack. If you're going to stack the blocks, I believe silverfish are better because uh, this season stuff sells for less. So that means that keeping the blocks and stacking them yourself is actually better uh, than selling them. So if you are going for island top, you might want to do silverfish and just stack those. Uh, even if you're going for island top, you could possibly still win with witches because you're going to be making more money in the long run and you could just start buying island level blocks faster. I don't know for sure which one's going to be better, but I'm going with witches just because I know I am not going to be stacking. Um, I need to get a cell portal farm set up. I haven't done that yet. I'll go ahead and show you guys my penguin island. It's it's kind of embarrassing right now. This is it so far. There is nothing fancy at all. I threw this up uh, within the first minutes of joining the game. I made a quick little IG farm up here. Uh, I put my villagers underneath and I made it where one alt could load everything. And then inside here... We have our uh, silverfish, our creepers, and uh, Giffo's got his alt down there collecting some XP. And then here, yeah, we just have our witches, creepers, and silverfish. Uh, stuff we're getting from crates and that sort of thing. And then if we take a look up here, I do have a uh, rooster and I have the frog. So I've been coming up over here. You get, you get pigs when you... Uh, uh, let me go ahead and do this so you guys can see. Those of you that don't know... Uh, oh my goodness, I cannot type today. There we go. Uh, if you uh, kill mobs while you have the frog out, you get loot. So some of the loot that you get are pig spawners. So I've been putting those here, and those are actually what I've been using then when I do use the frog. And then I also have the rooster, which I should probably have out right now. I've been having uh, Budley Neck running on the VPS, and while he's on there, I actually have a script that will uh, keep my rooster and frog out, and that way they level up when I'm AFK. Uh, maybe that's a good idea. That's something I've actually been wanting to do, and if I'm not playing so much this season, uh, it's been my goal to make a penguin script that the general public can use that's really easy. Most penguin scripts that are out there, including mine, which mine isn't out there, I, I wrote mine myself, uh, and it's complicated. I don't want to have to sit down and try to explain to everybody how to use it, because I know it, there's no way, I don't have enough hours in the day to be able to explain it to everybody and everybody getting it right. But uh, it has been my goal to write a simple penguin script 
where uh, I think everybody would be able to use it and it would kind of level the playing field for everyone. So I might work on that this season. That would be really cool. If you guys are interested in that, let me know down in the comments. Uh, maybe we'll set a like goal because that is that is a big deal and that's hard to do. Um, if this video gets, it's got to be something high. It's got to be something high to know for sure. If this video gets 50 likes. All right. I don't think I've ever got 50 likes on a video yet. If this video gets 50 likes, then I will set aside some time every day to start writing a script. I used to be a, uh, a full-time programmer, and a lot of you don't know that uh, uh, with Console Client, you can actually write scripts with C Sharp. So if you use C Sharp, it is much, much more powerful than the scripting language that they use. So uh, if this video gets 50 likes, I will sit down every night and I will try my hardest to come up with a script to run penguins. I already have a really good idea uh, on how it would work and it would be much better than what's out there and it would be much better than what I'm using, but it would be much, much more complicated and it would take a lot of time for me to get it done. Uh, but yeah, so we'll set a like goal on that. 50 likes and I will start working on that. I'll put some time aside every day and hopefully be able to do that. I think I can unless I come across some reason that I can't. But yeah, that's it so far, you guys. I've been doing this. This is it. Um, I've been just having fun, which is nice. I haven't been worried about winning. I've just been worried about doing what's fun and what sounds good. Uh, I also have an idea. I came up with an idea for a redstone contraption the other day. I think this is going to be my next video, but I'm going to make a redstone contraption. And it is going to be a shop rewarder. So in other words, every time somebody buys stuff at your shop, it will spit out a reward, a random reward for them. Uh, that way it will incentivize people to use your shop versus other people's shops. Now this season I'm not being competitive and uh, I'm probably not even going to set up a, a shop because I don't know if I'll have enough money to worry about buying anything. But maybe some of you guys will use it. And that way you can set your prices at the same as other people's. But maybe your pro your your shop's rewards will convince people to use your shop rather than the other person's. So that's something I think I'm going to do on the next video on here. Oh, I'm also starting another series. Uh, it is, do I have, yeah, I do have Optifine on here. Uh, I've been playing on the Lucidity server and I don't have a setup there with Optifine yet. I need to do that. So I can't zoom in when I talk. And I'm used to doing that and it bugs me there that I can't. So I need to get that set up. But I am starting another series and this other series is a Mind Saga series. I've had so many people in the comments asking me for help on uh, specific things. So like for instance, I had one comment that asked me how do uh, hoppers work? Which is very, very basic and I know a lot of people won't be interested in that. So I don't want to put it in my normal videos. But I'm going to make another series on Mind Saga. And this series will be a series that will be good forever. And this series is going to be called The Basics. So I'm going to do a video on each separate item. So each machine, I'll do one on the difference between all the hoppers, how things work, some of the game mechanics, how chunks work, how whatever, all, all different stuff. If you guys have any ideas or any suggestions or things you want to learn about, might be things I don't know about yet too, and we can uh, do experiments and figure it out together. Uh, if you guys have any suggestions or requests for that, let me know. That series is going to be called Mind Saga The Basics. Uh, and then if you see somebody asking questions, uh, you can just send them a link to that playlist and they will be able to find the answer to all of their questions right there. And that sounds like an amazing idea to me. I'm looking forward to doing that and I'm actually hoping to get some of those videos out very, very soon. So yeah, today we have been doing dungeons. That's what we've been doing today so far. Um, and that's about it, honestly. Just been playing, hanging out in chat, having fun with people, talking. Uh, doing some fishing contests. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I got an idea. I don't know if there's anybody out there that is good at parkour, but I have been doing some fishing contests, and I've got some parkour crates from that. I actually did a couple, and uh, yeah, I still I, I give up on them. I don't like them. So if anybody out there is good at parkour, the first one in the comments that asks for these will get them. 10 parkour crates. This is on the Mystic Realm, so if you're on a different realm, won't do you much good, but the first person that asks for these will get them. 10 parkour crates. Oh my goodness. If you're good at parkour, that is a really good prize. For me, that prize is junk because I wouldn't get a single prize from that anyway. I don't think I have ever beat a parkour on here. Okay, you guys, I just had an idea for something we could do today. This is uh, uh, just off the top of my head, just something that came into mind. Let's go ahead and do this. What if we do is warps and we just pick some random warps? Let's start at the top and let's see what people's warps look like. Let's do this. We'll call it random warps. Here it goes. We're at Azure's warp. 
and uh, wow they look their setup looks very similar to ours so apparently this is how a lot of people start out um what do they have going on here looks like they've been doing some mining Nah, pretty smart i bet they sit here in their mine cart and uh have their pick going to leveling it up out of that away that's pretty smart smart setup what else do they have going on here? They have some iron golems here. It's a nice looking iron golem farm. Uh, they got their enchanting set up. They got a generator. Looking very, very similar to ours. They got some cactus up there. Oh, I guess I didn't really show you guys our cactus. I did print a few chunks of cactus, but nothing at all like last season. I've got a few chunks going and uh, I got a few alts loaded. But if those of you that remember at the beginning of last season, I think I had like 20 alts loaded by day three or something. It was ridiculous. Um, all right, let's go ahead and pick another warp. Let's see who else. Let's just go ahead and let's go in order. Let's check out Chat Poyu. And, and the, it's funny, these are actually members of the team last season so far. And ooh, I like the purple and black. I do like that. I like the purple and black. And what do they got here? Is this donators already? Wow. He's already got a wall of donators. X Cyber donated a minion. Nice. Very nice, X Cyber. Those of you that remember last season, I did visit X Cyber's island, and it was amazing. They did a very, very cool island last season, and I think they're going to do another one. And let's. Oh, I see a rock lobster down there. They're mining that way. And what else they have going on? They got some sort of a farm here. I'm not sure what's going on there. And uh, they got something going over there. You know, that could be the uh, cell portal farm down there. That looks like that might possibly be that, like a silverfish maybe cell portal. Um. All right, let's check out the next one. This is pretty fun. We'll do one more. We'll check out Guaco ZK. Oh, what happened? Island is locked to visitors. All right, we'll do water drop. Ooh, I actually visited water drops earlier, and this one is pretty cool, you guys. Look at this. They have been working on their island, and there's water drop AFK right now. But this is a pretty cool look, I think. Pretty cool look. It's unique, and they're getting ready. They got their shop getting set up over here. The floor looks very nice, very cool pattern. And yeah, this is going to be a nice, I don't know if this is going to be a shop or a storage area. I'm not sure what they're going to do here. Looks like it's going to be a shop. But yeah, it's looking very, very nice water. Good job so far. Very, very nice. This was kind of a weird episode. I didn't have anything special or in particular to go over, but I did want to catch you guys up on what was going on and, and what I've done here so far and what everybody else has been doing. Like Ali Knack with his crazy... Crazy redstone uh, potion brewer over there. He's going to keep us stocked with potions all season, I think. And I want to let you guys know about all the new plans and the uh, the whole COPPA thing. And all of you 13 and olders, right? That's my target is definitely 13 and older. I do want to be family friendly. I'm not going to start cussing in that to make sure that it's obvious. Uh, I consider myself family friendly. I'm not targeting kids, but I am definitely family friendly. I'm a family guy. Uh, I have kids. I have a family, and I'm just not the type to cuss all the time. Oh, but thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Budley Neck with Season 4, and please help me get a goal this season, you guys. Come up with something for me to do. Uh, I don't even have a name for this yet. I'm just going to call it Season 4. Season 4. There we go. And this has been Budley Neck with Season 4. If you like this episode, do me a big favor and hit that like button below. And don't forget, if you want me to work on that penguin script, also hit that like button down below. If it hits 50 likes, I will start working on a public penguin script. If you're new to the channel and you haven't subscribed yet, maybe consider subscribing. Thank you so much for watching. Keep playing. Keep having fun. We will see you guys next time. Bye.